that Nail your ginger yeah. stop screenshot Nails be gleaming like a wristwatch Stay on freeze, it's the ice shop Ain't too many got what I got Nails be dripping, nails be dripping hi guys what's up welcome back to my channel so in today's video we've got a mail mail haul. okay so today we're going to be featuring the email couture um this is by max estrada's line this package literally took three months almost no, like three and a half months, like legit, like makes me not want to buy again because that's craziness. But let's open this. So I am gonna open with my scissors. I honest to God forgot what the hell I even ordered. So I have no idea what's in these things. Pink. Got like pink fluffy things in there. Nothing impressive. I know that some people actually got like cute ass packaging where it was like pink with like some sayings on it. Look at my gloves. <laughs> my gloves look crazy. So these are the brush wipes. They feel like they feel like the um like the Viva towels, except a little thicker, or the ones that um, are like blue paper towels that they use for cars that a lot of um, nail techs are using, or the ones that I have, which are by Scott as well. They're called rags, so another thing for cars. It feels like that, just a little bit different texture. Um, I will let you know how these guys work in my next video. I will be doing my busted crusty nails, so I will let you know. And we have, I think these are the, definitely the tools. Hi, hello. Wow. I can't even get it out. <laughs> oh, I ordered three tools. Okay, so. What do we have here? We have the, what is this? So the first one we have is the Petite Macaroon Brush. Um, I a brush. So what we have here is the Petite Macaroon um, Tool. This one has like a pointier edge. This is supposed to cut through acrylic, so you're not using, um, what do you call that? I forgot that cutting tool, but I'll write it somewhere here. I'll let you know how that works in my next video. And then I've got this other macaroon brush. It's a double-ended silicone. So this will be great to um, push in any pigments or chromes. And I believe this also cuts as well. Um, I have to research it again because it's been so long that I've ordered this that I don't even remember what I ordered. This brush is super cute, super duper cute. Okay. So, I don't know if you guys can see, the brush is slightly damaged. Got like hair sticking out, going different directions. I don't know if you can actually see that. So that's kind of disappointing, but you know what, whatever, I'll just, Cut those little babies. No point of her crying over spilled milk as they say. So let's clean it out. Let's see. It is a really good brush. It's really cute. Um, I believe this is a number 12 brush. I will say that for the amount of money you're spending, what's that? Um, the chrome is kind of messed up. The e-nail couture, it looks like it was painted on. So I'm actually kind of disappointed because it looks damaged. It's even more damaged than I realized, you see? So that's disappointing. The brush seems good, but again, I will be doing a full-on review. The cap is cute. 
those on. The cap is cute. It doesn't seem damaged at all. So, uh, I don't know. I don't know. For the amount of money I paid for this, I don't know how I feel. I do love this part. It kind of gives me Sailor Moon vibes. Now we have this box here. So, it's got to be the kit and the glitters, I am assuming. So these are the three glitters. What do we have here? Um, uh, no name. Wonderful. <laughs> no name. So I'm just going to figure out on the paper which is which or what I think it was. I will definitely put it on the screen as well as link it down below if you guys are interested. But I want to say... I want to say that this one here is I want to say this is pick me pure glitter mix again I'm gonna definitely link it somewhere here as well as down below but I want to say it's that I want to go ahead and say that this is the dolly dolly pure glitter mix and i'm gonna say this is the pink monster just because it's hot pink and i think that's the name but okay, let's go ahead and little litty little little oh that's pretty you guys that's beautiful oh i like that is really effing pretty oh child oh so this one that I think is the dolly color just because it's giving me like pretty cutesy vibes. So let's see. Oh, she's cute. Oh, yeah, Hunter. Look at that. Why am I being so annoying right now? I don't know. <laughs> Look at how pretty that is. And then lastly, we have this purpley, pinky. Oh, your mother. It's open. Oh, it's sparkling everywhere. Well, hello, Glitter. Okay, that's really pretty. That is really pretty. This actually kind of reminds me of, if you've ever seen the show, Monster High. Like, my daughter was obsessed with it for the longest time. It's giving me Monster High vibes, that Frankenstein Next, doll. we have, and final thing, because I didn't want to go crazy buying so much stuff, All right, since I've never used this box before. This is the Baby Kid um, System. Now, I hear that this smells like cotton candy. Right now, I'm only smelling monomer through this box, so uh, I don't know. Okay, so this is the monomer. I just opened the lid, which is good that they actually put this on it. Let's smell it and smell if it's cotton candy. I don't know. I'm scared because it's hype strong, y'all. I don't, I don't, I don't smell cotton candy. Like it has a, f a sweet scent, it does. And it's not strong scented as other monomers that I have. So I will say it's a very light, very low odor scent, which I love. I just don't get candy vibes, but that's okay. I'm fine with that. I am just getting a very sweet, almost, I don't know, I'm just getting a sweet monomer smell. Um, I wish I did smell cotton candy. I would make my life. Maybe I gotta shake it. I don't know. Warning for professional use only. <sighs> oh, yeah. Now I smell the cotton candy. Oh, you definitely have to just shake it up a little. Mm, so that does smell good. Okay, so what we got here? We've got chrome white. I don't know what that even means. White is white. Okay, so white powder, nothing special. <sighs> Jesus. <sighs> Glass pink. It's, this is pink. I don't, but, oh, sugar. I'm spilling shit everywhere. This, does, this is a clear pink for sure. For sure. Glass pink. Yeah, that's definitely. It reminds me of the Mia Secrets clear, except Mia Secrets have a little bit more pink in it. This one looks a little more clear <sighs> and i'm getting like <sighs> everywhere eternal beige now this color looks like it's gonna be promising and 
Do you guys see that? Do, do you see that? There's hair in it. Hello, right there. I gotta tell you, I'm not impressed. The first shop, <laughs> one thing that's impressed me so far is the glitters and the monomer and the wipes, but the brush, I'm disappointed on. This has a hair on it, <sighs> like, like for real. All right, guys, I actually want to do some swatches for you. I did take out the lint brush and um, prep my brush to see how this applies. And I'm gonna do some swatches for you guys. I put a little bit of it on the cap of the monomer. And so far, so good. I'm gonna take another wipe so that way we could do the swatches on so you get like a real legit thing. I know that I'm still, I'm still definitely gonna do the video because um, I do have like a whole idea of mine of what I'm doing. Um, but I still want to swatch everything for you to see what you guys you know, in case you guys are thinking about investing. I, like I said, his prices are definitely reasonable. Um, I, the only negative thing was the two things that I said. Not that I'm trying to be negative at all, but, um, you know, it, it is a review. So the, oh, there's no acrylic in here. Oh, these are pure glitters. Even better, I can do this on my eyes. Anyways, who cares? <laughs> I'm not going to do it on my eyes. But I wanted to show you how pretty is this? So this is glitter swatch one down. So that is really a thing pretty. Okay, so this is glitter, the first one. Look how pretty that is and reflective. So freaking pretty. Look at this, you guys. Oh, focus, focus. Hello? Hi. Oh, there we go. Look at how beautiful this is, you guys. Like the twinkle on this is superb. Like, you think it was cool? This one's beautiful. Like, it is a beautiful, like, hot pink. Take a little bit in the cap. And get a decent amount of it. You're definitely going to have to dab some clear acrylic first. So with this, you're definitely going to have to dab these glitters, um, clear acrylic, to, um, so that they don't get stuck or anything to the liquid. Uh, yeah. But look how pretty this is. It's a beautiful hot pink. Here. Um. Ooh, that's pretty. I don't know if you can see that on camera, but that is super pretty. I don't know. I don't think I even picked it up on camera. So we will pick it up now. Man, that is pretty. And this really, these napkins are really absorbing. So, and these tissue wipes, whatever, you, these brush wipes are actually really absorbing really nicely. Um, the brush so far, I do really like how it is applying. So I will say that that's great. Look at that prettiness. First we got is chrome lights. Oh, spilling everywhere. Hello. And the glass pink is exactly that a clear pink it's hard to tell because i am wiping it on a pink towel <laughs> hello <laughs> but that's fine I mean, this is a good clear if you want a little color. This is the one that had a hair in it. Mm. I think this has to be mixed up. It has like, I don't know what that is. Pink stuff. I'm gonna go with, I don't know what that is. But here is the beige. That's pretty. It's actually a really pretty color. Really color, really pretty color beige. Um, they swatch nice. I won't really know how they perform until like I actually use them. So that will be coming very soon and I will let you know for reals what I think. 
All right, guys, so I'm setting my brush, my brush to put it away, and I am even more disappointed with this brush. So look, okay, the cap, right? Obviously, it has a hole so it can breathe through. It doesn't even lock, okay? It doesn't lock, look. It goes right through. Like, and I have other brushes from different companies that does not do that. I'm trying to find one. Which, if you've watched my video in the past, you guys know I love the nail Glamour Couture brushes, and this locks right into place. You even hear the snap, you see? So, I, I gotta be super, look, it just, it just falls off. It's so flimsy. Like, I just gotta be really careful with it, I guess. Um, I don't know. I just wanted to show you guys but that. That is the end of this video. I really hope you guys like this haul. I hope it was informative. Eh, I gotta say, I don't know. I mean, I don't know how I feel, but I will do, like I said, a product review kind of thing later on for you guys with a video of me doing my own nails and then I will give you my full thoughts. Thanks so much for watching. Until my next video, peace and love y'all. Bye.